Hi, it's been a few weeks since I posted a video. Um, I haven't been feeling well, but I'm, at, I'm on medication now and, and I'm on the men. And um, I wanted to film this video since my husband helped me set this up yesterday. And um, yeah, I wanted to record any of their growth from this point on because they're probably going to be here now for the next couple of months. So we're back in the kitchen nook of my house. So let me back up. And if you remember, this is where I had my Monstera elbows and my Thai constellation and a few other plants sitting on this plant shelf. So that's west, that is north. So you can see the two window and that's exactly the corner of the house right there. And if you remember, I had my plants growing under an arrow garden um, machine, I guess, that my husband's friend gave me a few Hmm, was it last year or the year before? I've had it for a while before I actually started using it. And uh, I noticed that the albos and the Thai constellation, just about anything actually, which grew under the light, grew really well. So there it is, right there. My husband um, put a, <laughs> I don't know the name of it, but like sort of like a clamp thing um, to the wall. And then he was able to kind of separate the light fixture from the machine itself and so um, so this is now where I have my elbows uh, I have some of my mom's snake plants what else do I have over there I have a an orchid I have two or three orchids over there and um, some Easter and Christmas cacti the Christmas belongs to my mom the Easter is mine uh, some snake plants so anyways I wanted to film this so that um, as they continue growing here at this location, I can sort of just track their growth via video. So just really quick, so here are the two snake plants that belong to my mom. This is the Norfolk Pine. The poor thing's been losing leaves, so hopefully he'll like this spot. I had a good spot for him in front of the um, east facing window, but my husband kept knocking into it, so uh, he had to get moved. Um, so I do have the light on right now. It is about 7.30 in the morning, and today I think it's the 23rd of March. So, um, let me see. Let me go this way. And uh, so there's the Thai constellation over there. And if you can follow him, I have him on his pot, and I uh, flip the pot upside down so that he is higher up to the light, and that way I can get the um, plants to grow towards the light. So this is my elbow, one of my elbows. See, this one would be um, Flash, <laughs> if I remember their names correctly. This is his newest leaf, and as you can see, it's smaller than his previous leaf, which is this one. I had them in the bedroom for a couple of weeks because uh, I thought they were enjoying the southern window, the window that faces south, uh, to get the southern like afternoon light. And um, because I wasn't feeling well for two or three weeks, I couldn't, you know, set it up uh, in our bedroom. So sometimes they sat in the, not dark, but it wasn't very bright. And um, so uh, I blame this on myself. This could have been a nicer, bigger leaf. Hopefully under this situation with the uh, light that they will grow better or his leaf next leaf should be bigger this is my second elbow which is generally my first elbow uh, and he's growing very big as you can see he's also um, on a pot in a clear pot and that's what he looks like now he is growing a new leaf um, I can feel it when I touch the stem this one is the one I ha affectionately call my half moon same thing, I can sort of feel the leaf growing on the stem. And so he sits right there, also on a pod. That is um, my mom's spider plant. And then to switch over to the right, this is a, uh, I can't pronounce it, but it's a lady slipper, which likes a lot of water. Uh, it's like a frag. I can't think of its scientific Latin name. This is my Easter cactus, my mom's two Christmas cactus. This is uh, Bob, 
Bob's, it's an African violet, I can't think of its name. Here's Wally, and then back there is um, my spider plant, which I want on YouTube. I want a little cutting, and so um, there he is. So, this is now my current grow situation for my albos and my other house plants under the arrow garden light and hopefully I will see bigger leaves better growth um, on these plants in the upcoming weeks and months if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs down subscribe if you are interested in watching these plants grow I hope to do a garden tour out in the back uh, later today when it warms up a little bit and uh, that's it thanks for watching I'll talk to you later. Bye.